Alright guys, today I want to tie a variation of a pheasant tail nymph. Now, I've got quite a few of these in my fly box, but I've often found that subtle variations in a pattern can make a fish decide whether or not they want to bite. So we're going to secure black thread to our hook, snip off our tag in. And then I want this one to sink a little harder than my others, so I'm going to grab some lead-free wire and insert the end of it into our tungsten bead. Secure that with a few loose wraps to keep it from turning. before cinching it down. Fold it back over. Take a couple wraps behind it. Couple more wraps in front before we helicopter it free. Next, I'm going to grab a pheasant tail and select a few fibers. Separate at a 90 degree angle. I like to measure the tips to be about from the thread to the back of the hook. Transfer that to the bend. And doing the same process of a couple loose wraps to prevent turning. And then I'm going to cinch these down until we get to the bend of the hook. And return up to our lead free wire. Next, I'm going to grab some wire. Can't seem to find any of my brassy wire. Oh well, this will still work. Returning our thread to the lead free wire, folding those tail fibers back once again, Turn your thread to the head of the fly and grab about two strands of peacock curl and then tie them in at the head of your fly. Snip your tag ends off. and begin wrapping your peacock curl in closed touching spirals back to your pheasant tail it's at this point that I'm going to secure this portion of the peacock in place, but I'm not going to snip it free just yet. Fold the pheasant tail back over.
try to split them as evenly as possible. Pull them back. And continue wrapping your peacock curl. Snip your peacock curl free. Grab your whip finisher. And I usually take about four wraps. the thread free and then trim your legs to your desired length and there you have a pheasant tail nymph focus This particular pattern imitates mayfly and caddis larva pretty well, and since my local trout stream is full of caddis, I'm going to be tying a few of these. Thank you guys for watching. Bear winds, following seas, tight lines. See you in the next one.